Hey, it's Terry Gorry, and this is the Irish Law and Small Business Podcast. I'm going on video or going on holidays today with my good lady wife. We're going off for a week. During the week there, and up to yesterday, when people would ring the office looking for a consultation with me. Obviously next week was out because I wouldn't be there. Today is Saturday. Yesterday was Friday and I heard a couple of the girls answering the phone saying that I couldn't do a consultation next week because I was going away on annual leave. And I told them to stop doing that, stop saying that. There was no need to say that. And the reason for that, that people didn't need to know. I'm gonna fix this bloody thing. The reason people didn't need to know about the annual leave is because if somebody rings in and the earliest availability isn't next week, but towards the end of the following week and there's no mention of holidays then the caller who's looking for consultation is going to conclude that I'm in great demand and that I must really know my stuff and I must really be the man to see as it were and told the girls then to stop telling people what's going on holidays it's not that I'm being untruthful it's not that we're being deceptive. We're simply saying there's no availability next week. It'll be the middle or the, f- the end of the following week when I'll be available for consultation. And as I say, that sets up in the mind of the person who is inquiring that Jesus, this fellow must really know his stuff. So that, as far as I'm aware, or as far as I'm concerned rather, is thinking like an entrepreneur thinking like a small business owner. In other words, you are always looking to get a little edge. And the fact that I'm away next week on my holidays can actually be turned into a little edge from a marketing perspective, insofar as if we simply tell people the earliest availability for a consultation with this fella is 10 days time, they will probably draw the natural conclusion that he must be very busy and obviously there's no smoke without fire, he must know what he's doing. That's what I mean, and I think for any small business, you're always looking at the little edges. You're always looking at doing the right thing day after day after day, the small things, inch by inch, you will grow a business, grow a brand. Not, or very unlikely, on the basis of something going viral, or on the basis of something, something really blowing up. You're going to build your business, a successful business, by the little things, doing the little things right all the time. And you're going to have a ratchet effect. You're going to gain momentum after a certain period of time, because after a certain period of time of doing the little things right, you're going to reach a tipping point. You're going to reach a tipping point, and then you're going to get momentum. So that's me turning a negative as it were from the point of view of being available for consultations into a positive into a positive spin a positive message for me and my brand hope you can take something from this video if you do i'd appreciate if you give it the thumbs up down below thanks a lot